Well, good morning everybody. It's now the 27th of December. Um, I'm just starting to lift my dahlias. Um, I'm about a month or six weeks later lifting than I would like, um, but due to uh, not having an electric in my greenhouses uh, for the last few weeks, um, I finally got the electric back up and uh, so now I'm starting to lift uh, lift my dahlias ready for next year. As you can see, it looks a right old mess up the allotment here. Um, everything's obviously been blackened by the frosts. So I've started lifting some this morning and uh, they're looking pretty good. I wanted to get them lifted before we get any any further bad weather. Uh, now it's starting to get cold and uh, out of all the varieties that I've grown this year um, I'm going to reduce them down next year. I grew far too many varieties. So uh, oh, just uh, to show you what I've done so far. Uh, lifted a few um, Germanda and uh, and some Mary's Germanda and I shall put them all in, in, in these crates later on and take them home and put them in the uh, in the greenhouse uh, to dry off for, for a couple of weeks before I start them off again but basically when you're I expect most of you by this time have already dug all your dahlias up but uh, this is what you should be looking for um, when you dig them up for the winter. Uh, here's a tuber of Blight and Lady in Red, and it's got some nice, nice fat tubers on there. Um, that's quite a nice one. I don't like to have too big a tuber because I can't get so many on the bench. So that's quite a nice size, and uh, hopefully that will produce some nice cuttings in the, in the new year. Right, so I should take them home um, later today when I finish digging some up and I'll get them in the greenhouse and uh, yep gonna have a bit of a change round next year um, what I've worked out uh, to my cost this year one I've grown too many varieties and uh, so I'm gonna cut down to about 30 varieties next year and I'm gonna have my rows going across across the garden as opposed to going down the plot shorter rows and then they won't all fall over in the wind like they did this year and I got to, I couldn't get down the, the pile as they grew too big so big so a um, bit more space between the rows not quite so many plants and uh, less varieties but uh, I like to learn something new every year every year and hopefully uh, hopefully next year will be, be uh, a bumper year um, so uh, when I get these when I get all my tubers in the greenhouse later I'll put another video on I expect just to show you how I do it in there and uh, yep yeah, um, hope everyone had a good Christmas and um, and I uh, hope everyone has a prosperous 2015 bye bye